Approximately 2 million people in the UK have a severe visual impairment. This can create many problems in accessing information and in navigating around the environment. Numerous assistive devices are available to help with specific problems, but all too often, these are expensive, unattractive and bulky. And even if each device is not very bulky or heavy, having a different piece of hardware for each task is not a very practical solution. It is now possible to use apps on a smartphone to do many useful tasks. Smartphones often have text-to-speech technology built into them, so they can be used by people with visual impairments. Your destination is at 12 o'clock and 10 meters away. We can build on such existing functionality to create a range of apps that would transform the lives of people with disabilities. A problem often experienced by people with visual impairments is what Kevin Carey, the chairman of the Royal National Institute of Blind People, calls the last 10 yards problem. People with visual impairments often use a cane or a personal GPS device to help them find their way. However, due to the low resolution of GPS, such devices can guide a person to an approximate location, but they can still have considerable difficulty finding exactly where they need to be. For example, a GPS device can navigate a person approximately to a particular street address, but if that address is a large building, locating the entrance may be almost impossible. The Human Computer Interaction Research Group at York carried out a full user-centred design process which included focus groups with people with visual impairments. Researchers provided a safe testing environment using the Home Lab, which is located in the Department of Computer Science. From that research, we developed OptiNav, an iPhone app which allows a person with visual impairment to scan their immediate environment. The resulting images compared either with a Google Street View panorama or a custom-made panorama, and the user is then given spoken instructions to enable them to find the entrance. The directions are based on the clock face concept, which is commonly used by people with visual impairment. For example, an object is at 11 o'clock or move towards 3 o'clock. The OptiNav app was developed in association with a company called Spiral Scratch, a specialist in image processing, and it was funded by the TSB, the Technology Strategy Board.